Well, good to be back for the first time. Yep. Oh, hello. Oh. What what's what's going on? What's uh, going on, Jason? Uh, what are you doing? Uh, what are you doing? <laughs> Gary Marsh fans in town, everybody, look out! <laughs> yeah! oh! Welcome back to Red Redemption Two. Uh, I'm Jeff. I'm Jason. You got to go into the bank. Oh Jason. yeah, we're not. You're going to go to the bank. I was like, do I need to sneak in the back and shoot somebody? <laughs> oh no, 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 we're just getting alone. Hello, can, I, can I help you? No, I need to talk to your yeah. manager. Uh, My name I th- is Karen. Actually, I think you do have to talk. Oh, never <laughs> yeah. mind. You're just walking right in. Can I help? Hey, give me all your money. He looks like um. Who's that? Who's that guy? Who's that X-wing pilot from uh? Snap. J J Abrams, yeah. buddy. Snap, Snap Wexler. Is that his name? Yeah. I was thinking of the actor. Oh yeah. Uh, oh, that old dump. Uh, Greg Grunberg. Greg Grunberg. There you yeah. go. I ain't much of a fan Officer Matt Parkman. I will get there. That is a very unusual way of asking. You know, John, you're not pitching this very well. <laughs> hey, man, can I have some money? I want to yeah. buy the crap farm yeah. that nobody can grow anything on. Way to look nice when you go get a loan, which you lunatic. Mr. Geddes, I work for him. He said that you could help me out. I mean, if you can. Wait a minute. Are you that guy that killed all those people? I'm trying to man to loan a man with two names money so he can buy a rundown farm. <laughs> On account of his lack of farming skills. He makes a point. (laughs) He makes a good point. That is a compelling (laughs) argument. How would you put it? Well, I have a gun. Give me the motherfucking farm! (laughs) Sit down. I'm sure we can figure something out. Now, of course, we'll be expecting you to make regular payments, and given a lack of much evidence you got any means of repaying, the terms won't be too great. But if my cousin vouches for you, it'll be okay with the bank. Okay. Absolutely. If only that was the way it went these days. <laughs> how do you how do you think this guy feels at the end of Red Dead Redemption when the bank repossesses Beecher's Hope and it's just full of blood and dead yeah. dead federal agents and shell casings and, and everything? Zombies. <laughs> yep, and zombies. Check out the land while I fix the contracts and talk to Mr. Geddes. Oh, I heard there's squatters up there. We've been having some. Not for long. They'll need clearing on. Sure. Come back when you're done, and we'll fix up the... Hey, that's strange. I call my rifle the squatter clearer. <laughs> Squat clearer. <laughs> this, is some kind of, this is the worst battle axe name in the world. It does. <laughs> Squat clearer. The Tennessee Walker. Yeah. Mm, that's close to Kentucky. I, we need the Mississippi... The Mississippi... St- oh, that's the <laughs> wrong button. <laughs> my apologies, horse. <laughs> That is, it is not that button. <laughs> Just punch that horse right we, in the gut. We got off to a bad start here, my friend. Here, oh, here. Just here I'll give you a little. That guy comes up, he's like, hey, man, did you just punch that horse? No, mind your own business. <laughs> what's the, What's your problem with the horse? Don't worry about it. He owes me yeah. money. My bad, horse. <laughs> that, ha, yeah. Yep, that's, all, uh, all is forgiven. Here, also have, have an apple. Have an apple. Well, I am very sorry. <laughs> Jason did that to me one time. You remember when you slapped me on your hand, just Sebastian Joust, oh, and then he just yeah. brushed my hair and gave me an apple. I, and I, I was did. forgiven. So. Yeah. <laughs> Same thing I did to Grant after I kicked him in the boing lungs. Oh, yep, yep. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <sighs> Which I did not do on purpose. Totally slapped you on purpose. Did not mean to kick Grant squaw. Holy shit. I just had a... I, just saying the words, oh, boy... Gave me the. I have the idea for the greatest game of all time, Jason. Let's hear it. I mean, it if you want to share it, it's an anthology game. And it's a quantum leap game where yeah. you literally go into different video games. Oh. So like, you're gonna play an hour of The Witcher Three as Sam jumping in to try to fix what Geralt once made wrong, uh, and then you're gonna go to Red Dead, and then you're gonna go to Street Fighter, I and mean, you're gonna go to, like Final Fantasy. I'm 100 <laughs> percent in. And it'll be like it'll be like you're playing this game except that uh, Dean Stockwell is just right beside you with Ziggy, and he's telling oh. what you have to do. You had me a uh. quantum leap. You know that. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be great. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. You can resurrect. Maybe, maybe, maybe you could just... Oh, you know what you could do is if you could, if you could find a way to pry the rights out of the hands of a bunch of dead franchises. So, like... Wing Commander, oh. or like No One Lives Forever. Oh, No or, One Lives Forever. Uh, like, uh, God, uh, one of my favorite games of all time. Silent Hill. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Let's just take Konami. Oh, all what of are you doing? Oh, my God. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> this horse is, <laughs> wow. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, you should yeah. punch your horse more often, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> well, uh, I set the stage like, listen, don't fuck around. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That'd be great. That'd be great. I'm going to make that game. I would play that. 
What are you doing? Get off the horse. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my god, I thought he was gonna like <laughs> suplex his horse for a second. Right. So, hey guys, uh Oh, hang on. Uh, hold on, I gotta clean my gun real fast. Yeah. R three. You gotta clean. There we go. How many times over the course of this game have we cleaned our gun? Like three times? Not enough. Yeah. I, I was I mean, looking at one of our old comments like, this is stupid. They they don't even know that they don't even need to clean your guns. It's like, yeah, you kind of do, <laughs> asshole. Yeah, it makes your guns less good. Also, don't read the comments. It just don't read the comments. Hello. Hi. What's up? You're going to die in a minute, yep. but I'll be back. Gentlemen. Hello, Cletus. Or Stranger. Hey, Hello. buddy. I hope so. Who's in charge here? No one, mister. Oh. This free country. <laughs> well, <laughs> now I'm in charge. This is a communist collective. I'm buying this land. <laughs> so you know. We have taken back the means of production, <laughs> mister. You guys are going to have to go somewhere else. Who's this? I ain't sure. Some fancy Dan city boy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Fancy you can, Dan. You can call John Marsden a lot of things. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Fancy city boy ain't one of them. You guys are kind of, you guys are a little, uh, give money, <laughs> please. <laughs> hey, uh, Fancy City Boy, uh, oh my god. Oh Dude, shit. They kicked your ass. Oh, and then John Marston died. I underestimated <laughs> them. <laughs> that's I mean, what, you'd think you shoot a guy a couple of times. That's what, uh, fucking Deadeye is for, man. What, did you give them money? On accident, oh, shit. Oh, you give them 10 We only have $20. You for I, real? I didn't mean sure, to do that. It. <laughs> it was, I, I wasn't. <laughs> Your fucking pacifist run of Red Dead Redemption 2. What? John Marsden does not. <laughs> Damn it. Ah! No! He was pushing the pull out your gun button as hard as he could. Oh! It was it was amazing. I just hit the wrong button. Yep. First you let him shoot you, then you bought him off. John Marsden. I'm disgusted with myself. <laughs> let everyone down. I'm very sorry. Yep. <sighs> this is bullshit. <laughs> you want to reload the game? Maybe. To kill those three guys. Maybe. <laughs> oh man. I'm so disappointed in myself. It's a cooperative bank. It's so like all the tellers own a piece of the bank. That's weird. Ah, it's you. The man with two names and no past. That's the name of my autobiography. How'd you make out? Well, let's just say there are all no tongue. Fathers. Okay. Well, I got your paperwork ready. Now, you sure about buying this place? It's really run down. Yep, I'm going to open up a showbiz pizza. I think it would mean a lot for my wife. At least mean I was listening to her. Okay. Well, can I take out a secondary me. loan for some animatronic banjo players? <laughs> they must be animals. The Rock of Fire Explosion. <laughs> mm -hmm. Did you watch that documentary about the Rock of Fire Explosion? I did not. I it is amazing. It was interesting. Really? really? Yeah, I liked it a lot. But then I went to showbiz all all through my childhood. Oh, so. me too. I I still have some showbiz tokens. At oh, home. well, goddamn. Yeah. Do they course. still use tokens at Chuck E. Cheese. I don't know, man. Chuck E. Cheese is the bad version. I don't go there. Yeah. I haven't been to a Chuck E. Cheese in decades because I know it'll just break my heart. Also, what are you going to do? Go there to eat the substandard pizza and play video games you can play at home? <laughs> I know. Watch an animatronic rat play the drums or something? Well, I was thinking no until you said animatronic rat playing the drums. If that's still a thing, I'm in. I'm joking. They own me. They just own your property. Now, you can also use this line of credit for any home improvements you need. Man, Dutch home. would be so mad at him. Like a moat. For taking out a home loan. Well He'd be like, <laughs> this is America. There's supposed to be freedom. We're free about. men. I'm just joking. <laughs> this guy. Go. Get, I don't think anybody go really. Go to the chuckle hut, you weirdo. <laughs> don't try your stand-up routine on me. I'm a rancher. Hey! Shut the fuck up. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Go away. Come here. Oh my god, you smell like cheese. Going into the bank, and by the looks of things, you ain't. Want that lady to give him the stink eye as she walks by? No, for real. Well, I'm trying. 
all these years. Yeah, he you don't look like you're trying very hard, to be honest. Bit. You know, my friend, uh, my, I have the old high, this old high school friend, Jason, that's yeah. in like a punk rock band in uh, Denver, Colorado. Yeah. Uh, he's got the exact vest that John Marsden is wearing. It's like a jean. It's like a jean, a black jean jacket with the yeah. arms ripped off. Sure, of it. Yeah, except that his has all the buttons and like patches and patches stuff on, on it. Operation Ivy. Yeah, and some some that, little yeah. studs on the shoulders. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. I just realized it. I was like, where have I seen that before? <laughs> oh my god, is your horse dirty, Uncle, or is that just the way it's colored? Follow me. I guess maybe we can lose him. <laughs> Better Game keep up. Game over. You <laughs> lost <laughs> uncle. I know. Game over. You didn't answer Dutch's phone call. What are you, what are you doing? Are you slaloming? Well, you no, I was looking at the map, and the map, like, s switched directions for a second, so I started to follow. Don't make you seem interesting. It makes you seem stupid. Shut up, asshole. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I love is the fact that, like, Uncle is like the C-3PO of this franchise. He's like the, <laughs> the one big constant between the two games, yeah. right? And that, and that, and that, uh, and that John lets him live at his place. Now, wait, is he related to Abigail? Is he Abigail's? I don't know that they ever. Like father's brother or something? Did they ever establish, like, who? I don't know. I don't know. Actually, you can run from a bank. They're pretty easy to run from. They stay <laughs> yeah. in one place. It's a like, building. Yeah. Jack waiting until I'm set up before joining me out here. <laughs> you mean she left we're, we're doing Shut it. Shut up, Uncle. We're going off road. You don't want to hear Uncle berate you? <laughs> I don't want to hear Uncle, period. Yeah. He's the first one to turn in the in Undead Nightmare, right? He is indeed. Uh, God. Just trying to think of how many hours you and I have played Red Dead. <laughs> I try not like, to think about it. There was the the there was the spill episodes, the rage select episodes, Undead Nightmare, Red Dead Two. We're just gonna start over at Red Dead One, and then we're gonna. Right? Well, no, after, after this, when, when this is over, we're when this go is over, right we're gonna go to Red Dead One. Episode, we're gonna go to get to level one hundred in Red Dead Online, right? Oh, that's like, right. Yeah. yeah. What do you think? I haven't even tried that in a while. Wonder what's going on there. For Abigail. Why? You an idiot? No. What were you she comes back. He's like, know. baby, I she bought all this for you. And she just turns <laughs> around and walks away. Are we going to farm here? Rocks. Rocks? <laughs> yeah, you're not going to farm shit. Hand at the tail. Enough of that. Get out of here. On your way. <laughs> yeah. No, you're stuck with me. Thinks I'm stuck with you. John, the rock farmer. <laughs> so... You think I'm an idiot? No. I know you're an idiot. Ah! Man, I feel like Uncle would be good at a roast. Like the, the Comedy Central roast of Dutch Vanderland. I think we should close the door and set the building on fire. <laughs> roast him alive. <laughs> yep, thanks for the... <laughs> yeah. Thanks for the help, Uncle. This is what it's like at the Modern Rogue HQ, right? It was <laughs> dragging rocks over somewhere for quite a while. It was, uh, it was, it was a little sketchy. Yeah, exposed wiring. I haven't been up insulation. there insulation since it's become like a place. It's, uh, it's yeah, it's it's getting there. All there right, epilogue part two. Yay, Beecher's Hope. Did you ever go to uh, Armadillo? Uh, you probably yeah, did it in the online yeah. game, though, right? Because I, I, I don't think there was like a there wasn't a mission there. Yeah, in this. I know I did it in the online game. I'm not sure if I did. Yeah, it wait in a minute, that's point. not how you build a fence. You yeah, you, we already you, learned how to do that, and he's doing it wrong. Yeah, fucking John Marsden, you got a four hundred dollar bank loan. Did you just get a gold medal? Yeah, in that w that one mission in the go to the bank mission because I killed it, man. Oh, it's because you spared I... those guys. Oh. That's why you got a gold medal. Oh. Oh, it galls you. Mm. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. I guess that Hey, was look, it's an uncle. Accident. It's an uncle mission. <laughs> oh, just trying hey, to get uh, off. Good Lord. You need to just call out. Fella. <laughs> You're okay. You're Are you okay. a Lipizzan or Stallion? Why are you <sighs> dancing around like that? What's, what's, hey, your, what's your problem, horse? All right. I think this horse has the devil in it. Do you know him. any Kentucky Saddlers? Let me get a horse exorcism. Brush him. Take care <laughs> of my horse. Okay. There we go. You fine now? Good. All right. Being such a prima donna. <laughs> <laughs> 
I don't believe that after all the time that they've done this, that they're still just in this this shack. It's the lumbago. I am I overdo it. I, I'll get a relapse. It's very serious. Get What's up. lumbago, Jason? Out. I don't even know. So, Is that like gout? I don't know. Constipation? Guess you're my proof I'll never quite outrun my sins. We need to get him a shave so bad. I know. No wonder she left you. It's like rooming with the King James Bible. Kick the hell out of him. There you go. Yeah, right in the kidneys. I, I'm getting up. Oh, no, wait, what did I have to tell you? I, I went into town. And, oh, I got, I got a little drunk. Should you spend all our money on Funyuns? No, we got to go. What? We what? Go to San Denis. Why? Why? Charles. What? Charles Smith is alive, I reckon. Oh. Charles Smith alive. Well, he's really? useful. I yeah. Reckon. I like Charles. I yeah. We had many romantic uh, little nighttime <laughs> boat cruises. <laughs> Charles right. is one of the only people in the gang that was worth a damn. Yep. Yep. Charles, Lenny, yeah. pretty much all the women. And <laughs> yeah. Albert and, and John, everybody else kind of sucked. I don't know. You know what? I, I take that back. Bill Williamson's too stupid to be evil. He's just a big, <laughs> dumb galoot. Yeah. <laughs> like... This is a stupid uh, ogre. He doesn't know no better. Let's get off. <sighs> Back in San Denis. Even though, you know, I'm never like this place. Javier wasn't exactly like the, the devil either. Like, oh, yeah, know. that's true. We had to kill him in Red Dead 1, and I never felt like he really deserved it. Yeah. Let's go find that big sour bastard. Oh, damn. I just realized that we never did the... We never did Albert like uh, go into the movies with his squeeze quest. Oh, we didn't, did we? Yeah, that was a sad story. Yeah, that 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 mission made me legitimately sad because it's like um, he does that thing at the end where he's gonna he's gonna stretch and then put his arm around her and then he just doesn't and then it's like over and I she's know. like goodbye and it's like oh great that yeah. was horrible. It was heartbreaking. Uh, but that's after also like her, her dad's a drunk, and he sold her jewels or something. Yeah, we had to something go get him like back. That, right? Just horrible shit. All right. Will you move? What? What was that? Uh, uh, I don't know. <laughs> Did we do all the missions with the with the church lady? <laughs> Oh my God! No. <laughs> Body check. <laughs> Body check. <laughs> that guy saw it. He's like, he I did. know what's coming. Yep. <laughs> Ooh -ha! Uh, actually, that was the fence was in there. Oh, that's okay. one of the places you're supposed to be checking for Charles. <laughs> Except she's gonna go. <laughs> what? Oh, uh oh. I think <laughs> that was pretty good. I think I got like four of them, three of them. <laughs> I think you're gonna get a bounty on your head. For being clumsy? Yeah. No. You're not being clumsy. You're fucking. You're like it was an accident. Shoulder checking people like a <laughs> linebacker. <laughs> there's clumsy, and then there's rushing the thirty yard line. <laughs> All right, what you got? How can I help you today, sir? Listen, you seen a big Indian fella? Huh. Indian? <laughs> yeah, a boxer. Nope. Sorry, what is with the two identical clocks? Yeah, that's uh, weird. Are those bowling trophies? I don't know. He, I think he's fighting, I believe. Fighting out behind Saint Saturnin. Thank you. What the hell? What does that mean? No I don't know. Apparently, John knows what it means. Saint Saturnin. Is that the same guy that was running the slave basement? Uh, I don't know if it's the same guy, but this is definitely the same place. Yeah. Uh, okie dokie. Fucking Saint Denis. All right. I really wish that they had DLC. Like, there's so many, so many, so many like buildings in this town full of people that could have a quest line, and just nope, 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 nope. We gotta do fucking battle royale deathmatch. Yeah, that that is way less interesting. Then again, I haven't, I haven't <laughs> checked to see if. Oh, oh what? shit! What? That's right. You sauced, you sauced the noodle one too many times, Jason. It's not letting me fight him. Well, there you go. Try this. It's not letting me punch him. X button. You try pressing all the buttons. Yes. You try pulling your knife. <laughs> I think it's because you're like, go to Uncle. Break off. 
It's not letting me punch him. Break off, Jason. I'm trying, but he's got me in the freaking corner. Nobody puts baby in a corner. Damn it. <laughs> Does he say bazinga? Oh, my God. Get out of there. Get, I can't. Get back up a little bit at a time. This hobo is going to kick my ass. <laughs> this hobo is going to murder you. This is this is karma for running down all those people in the bazaar. You're going to die. Uh, I'm trying. <laughs> It's how? It's not letting me punch How him. do you get into these situations, Jason Murphy? Where are the police? <laughs> Uncle, help me, you piece of shit. There it is. <laughs> oh, nope. You still got a little left. <laughs> I couldn't punch him. <laughs> it wasn't letting me hit him. <laughs> you failed to fight Charles. That's what happened. Yeah. Yep. I oh just had to God. sit there and take it. Yep. Or dodge until my stamina ran out. No, uh, you. Yeah, your core was uh, was empty. Okay, <laughs> so you know, if you want to kill somebody, just knife them. <laughs> right. I, I couldn't uh, pull up my wheel either. Oh man, because I totally. Oh god, you have to go. You have to go all the way back to the fence. Uh, it's all the beginning. Uh, this happened last time too, and you ran that cart off the road at the beginning of Epilogue One. <laughs> Fine. Oh man! Fine. Hey, <laughs> got you're still doing I'm it. I'm doing it. <laughs> I'm gonna body check fools all the way there. Yep. Woo! <laughs> John Marsh is standing E linebacker. Play for the Sanity <laughs> Saints. Woo! <laughs> My watch out! Uh, Break train! That's a, that's a fucking that's a cop. cop! That's a cop! That's a cop! You're gonna get. Oh my god! That's a cop! I gotta get out of here. That's a cop. He Most told you to beat it. I'm he said to scram. It. I'm scramming. Scram, you, you, you. I don't know another old timey word for a. You scalawag. Uh. You scofflaw. All right. I'm knock him. Oh, oh yeah. sorry. Oh. Should have body checked the horse. <laughs> if you could body check a horse. We install a mod to let you body check the the uh, uh, carriages. I need to. What are you doing? I'm gonna eat some corned beef. Just <laughs> drink it straight from the can. <laughs> yeah, it's like my oh double <laughs> double score. <laughs> yeah, we created a new Here game. We go. It's called people bowling. Target rich environment. Ooh. Boom. Ooh. Ooh. Boom. Uh, boom. Uh, boom. Uh, boom. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that wasn't quite as good as. Yeah, I got that double earlier, though, so I'm pretty happy with myself. Oh, my God. Right. Knock, knock. <laughs> Where's Charles? Yep. Tell me about the big. Fighting, big, blah, blah, blah. Big Indian. You want to come around from behind the counter and yep. talk to me about football? <laughs> Bonjour. How can I help you today, sir? Listen. I need to buy a bird cage. Wait, where's the other clock? The other clock is gone. Oh, oh, oh there it is. Nope, there Wait. it is. Was it just behind you the whole time? No, I was just sitting right there on the counter. Oh, okay. Actually, yes. I think it's Can I get one of them Doc Crockett's? What is Doc Crockett's? Doc Crockett's what? I don't know. It just says Doc Crockett's back there. All right. So he's in a fight club. Yeah. Is this is like a like a like a Tyler Durden fight club or just like a uh <laughs> Yeah. Oh my okay, God. you didn't go down. I'm going to spare you cuz you're standing by the wall. You're in trouble, sir. Oh, oh good dodge. Good dodge. You gotta Got keep some moves. You gotta keep your head on a swivel in San Denis. <laughs> no sitting in public. You're loitering. Uh oh shit. She turned hostile on you. Oh she turned hostile. I'm like the juggernaut. <laughs> oh. oh I, I better I better be nice now. Uh oh. Uh oh no, uh -oh. no. Coming. Coming. they're coming, coming for you. You gotta no, follow coming. follow him. Oh no, no, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. It's cool. The guy was getting ready to I know. wreck your shit. Woo! <laughs> The next three episodes is just Jason <laughs> trying to find Charles. You are a killer. What's oh hey. Oh boy. Hey Charles. Hey, What's Charles. Up? Your hair looks pretty. Somebody bite you on the back? John? You're you're I'm Jim. I'm Jim. Name's Jim. Be cool. Yeah. Be cool. Oh, what are you doing? He was eating spaghetti earlier. Spilled some yeah. sauce. Is that ragu? Maybe yep. He was in some sort of trouble. Kind of, kind of just have you tried killing everybody? I mean, Throwing you know. Fights for a few dollars. Throwing fights? Throwing sure. fights? What? We could just murder everybody and like take that? all their stuff. Of course not. So Why don't you win so the fights for more yeah. dollars? Holy shit, is that me behind you? Oh, my God. <laughs> Double Gary. <laughs> <laughs> Double Gary. Oh, man. Abigail's still alive. It's fucking she Satan me. screwing around she with him. <laughs> Abigail's still alive, too. Me. And my stupid son. Yeah. 
On who? On myself, to win. Lone Wolf. How much? Sixty-five, okay. one dollar. Lone Wolf McQuaid, that's my second favorite uh, Chuck Norris movie. But the odds just got real good. What about you, sir? A uh, little wager on the wolf here? Sure. Real redskin brave. Bet on Charles. Yeah. Always bet on Charles. Give me a bet on him. Have I got a treat for you? An epic battle. Uh oh. All of it? I didn't know we were betting all yep. of it. Bet it all. You went all in. Should I charge the crowd? I'm kind of tempted to charge the crowd. Tap to, tap to get near the fight and get a better view. Unless you want to start this mission over again. <laughs> hit the hit the cinematic camera. Savage. Okay. He's racist. No no weapons, no forfeiting, no crying like a beaten child. Everything else goes. He's fighting Irish Wolverine. Oh man. You win by retirement or you win by death. Let's have a good fight, boys. Let's keep it They're beating each other to the death in the back alleys of uh, San Denis. Mr. Lone Wolf, sir. Focus on Charles and then you can cheer. Go Charles! Yeah, fuck him up. I bet it literally everything on him, on you, oh, Charles. Jesus so. Lord. Okay. Yeah, that's Pretend a, he's Micah. Do it. <laughs> you talk to that other guy, you're just like, hey, Fatso, guess who's dying tonight? <laughs> oh, God. All right. Do not mess with Charles. Yep. What about your winnings? Made my months, but you also made some fellas mighty unhappy. So it goes. Here's your share, partner. Thank you. We just made the bed. I said we so you keen on staying around here or heading off with me and Uncle? So he's been he's been throwing he's been uh uh butch butching in uh, Pulp Fiction basically yeah. is yep. what happened here. He's taking dives. Yeah. That's pride. That's how they that, that that's how you're gonna beat him, Charles. They're just gonna keep underestimating you. Yep. I need to go back and watch Pulp Fiction. I think it's on Netflix right now. Uh, yeah. God. I watch that at least once a year. It's one of my favorite movies of all time. And it's still just brilliant. And Tarantino's best, I believe. Did you watch uh, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood? I did. I liked it. I, I did. I actually, it's weird. I didn't like it most of the way through. And then the last 20 minutes, I was like, oh, I get what you're doing now. Like, like, I hope you like <laughs> watching Brad Pitt drive around Los Angeles. Yep. Yep. Because there's a lot of that. It's also yeah. weird because uh, Margaret to... Qualley, you know, the woman who was getting in his car. Her name's oh. Margot Robbie. No, no. Oh, no I'm messing. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the, little... the Manson girl that was getting yeah, yeah. in his car. Uh, she was in um, Death Stranding. She was like the, oh, no kidding. the scientist, in, oh, one of the scientists in Death Stranding. Oh, yeah. And so I played the fuck out of Death Stranding, and then I saw Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, and I was like, oh, cool. Oh, That's neat. weird. Watching this, like kind of funky scientist turned into this weird like jailbait character in uh in that movie yeah it was a little strange <laughs> gary don't <laughs> pretend like you've got the plans to build a house you just it's just a crayon it's a box with a triangle on top of it a little curly q coming out of the, the smokestack yeah so you know how to build a house, right? Because I don't. I can teach you how to make a fence, though. I know how to make <laughs> yeah. a make the hell out of some fences. Dutch? Who knows? Dead? Maybe? I'm not sure. John, John, you should be more concerned about what's going on with Dutch. <laughs> yeah. For real. I ain't heard nothing real in years since, well, that time. Which time? The time that he left you for dead or the time that he tried to kill you? <laughs> Speaking of them agents. What? We're talking Micah now? Yeah. Or since before I got off Sisica. Is that the prison island? Yeah. The agents made a real mess of them. Oh boy. Died in custody. Oh. Never said a word. Really? Guess some folk as strong in ways you can't see. I would have expected Strauss to just sing. Yeah, there's also the, the question of did they just like 
did they just shoot him in the face and, and be done? I mean, like, hey, where are your friends? He's like, I'll never say it. And they're like, okay, bang. Like, yeah. we're not going to fuck around these days. What? Careful. Why? Where are we going? Guido Martelli's men. Who? Oh, boy. Maybe we should go to a different state, Jason. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> One where everybody doesn't know who we are and what I mean, we've done. We pretty much killed everybody on Guarma, so you just take care of that. Just go colonize. Now, now we're going to a fist fight. Oh, oh shit. Fight. Oh, not a fist fight. Hey, man, I made you a lot of money, all right? <laughs> Uh, was that a cop? Uh, well, you, you you're wanted now. Yep. Okay. Get on the wagon. What wagon? With Why Charles, the the dot, the dot. Go to the dot. Oh, Charles had to pick up his oh, fucking he got, he had to get his suitcase. Back. Right, right, right. Damn, dude. Now we're wanted by the police. Who cares? <laughs> I kind of like how much you hate Uncle. God, he's just such a worthless sack. Yeah? I don't know. I kind of warmed up to him. You, know, you ever have that friend who's a worthless piece of shit? Yeah. <laughs> you still just kind of hang out with? No. No? I oh, cut okay. all of those people out of my life. I mean, there's like, there's Except worthless. Except for one. <laughs> <laughs> there's, there's worthless piece of shit, and then there's Uncle. Uncle's just kind of like, he doesn't do anything. Like, he's just kind of a lump. Well, I wasn't planning, planning on, on getting surrendering myself. In, yeah, yeah. I, I got more body checking to do. Yeah, <laughs> I got a new sand and knee hobby. It's a new pastime. I call it cowboy pinball. <laughs> if I ever want to go back, remind me. Oh, you know we didn't do the side quest with the remote control boat either, did we? Oh yeah, the little Tesla thing. Yeah, we did not. Or or the, the, the robot. robot. Yeah, that yeah. one was pretty neat. Also, don't don't. Don't at me. This is episode 68, I believe. So, like, you know, you boys been the, up we, we played enough Red Dead Redemption. <laughs> yeah. We played 30 hours plus of Red Dead Redemption 2. Well, it weren't very good shots. Come on, let's head for home. <laughs> Uncle, put your hat on. You're going to sunburn your head. It's going to peel. You're going to be pe peeling oh. your head. and. Bald peeling heads. Gross. Oh. Gross. Yeah. All right. Well, I think that we're we're probably just about to wrap this one up because surely we're not just going to dive right into more story. Uh, so thanks, everybody, for watching. Hit the like, subscribe button. Uh, if you like this series, share it out to somebody on social media. I know that we say that, but, you know, uh, YouTube has decided they hate us. Uh, also, I'm going to update the playlist this week so they'll be like, you can just watch the whole fucking thing in a row if you're a crazy person. Uh, <laughs> watch 30 hours. Oh, that's, that's More than a day. That's way too much of us. More than a day of you and me getting sidetracked and being like, oh, I don't remember what's going on. Um, so, yeah. Patreon.com forward slash Rage Select and YouTube.com forward slash Modern Rogue. And we'll see you next week for more Red Dead. And that's it.